It's Tuesday, about 8.06 p.m. I should be asleep, <laughs> but I'm not. I am wide awake and in my bathtub. Imagine that. Yeah, um, I don't remember what I talked about in my last video. I usually don't know what day it is. <laughs> my dogs are saying hello, but you can't see them. That's Bella, don't eat the bubbles. Yeah, um, so things are still good, but they're incredibly crazy. That's Bella's head. Bella. I don't know if I can make her taller, probably. Yep, I will eat the bubbles. Come here, you can get it. Yeah, um, so I've been trying to get my doctor to mail the pharmacy here a script. And for some reason, that's been incredibly difficult. Don't know why. Uh, so I'm on a pain medication. I can't get a home health nurse to come out, even though I have the okay for supplies. I get a letter in the mail today saying that my doctor has dismissed me from his practice because I haven't paid the bill, which is great. Um, I have lots of bills to pay, and I don't even know what that one is. Um, but I'm guessing it's more important than the four hospitals that are trying to collect money from me right now. So, I guess tomorrow I'm going to try to sort that out. I'm not very excited about it, considering I don't have the funds. Um, I don't get paid until Monday. I don't have a day off until Saturday. I'm working thirds, and I'm training to be a med tech. I really enjoy the job. It's at an Alzheimer's, uh, and it's just a living facility. And, um, it's like theater 24-7 with nursing. Uh, although, I do get the irony pretty often, um, when I have residents who look at me in ways that I am absolutely sure without a shadow of a doubt I have looked at other people. Um, it's provided a very, very interesting perspective for what it's like to deal with me when I am post-dictal. Speaking of post-dictal, I'm guessing by how happy I was in my video, I haven't talked about how I um, wrecked my car uh, pretty recently, and uh, we don't really know why nobody else is involved when I was on the highway. And since I don't have a doctor, I also don't have a referral to a neurologist that I have been trying to see about my seizures. Or whatever they are. We're at a point where we don't call them seizures, we just call them events. Well, whatever they are, they're a pain in the ass, and... Yeah. Um, I'm really trying to get better, but I'm also really, really uh, wearing myself out. I don't know if you can tell, but I have some funk been going around and I definitely have it so there's that um yeah I mean there's a lot going on but I still like it here and um I'm not bored with it yet I'm just very 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 tired um uh, and worn down and it's concerning because that's when things happen but what can I do, you know? Um, I realized that in about a month um, or so, I should have been dead. <laughs> um, well, let, let's go back. If you've watched this long enough, I should have been dead probably six years ago. But um, I sort of revel in the fact maybe it's the part of me that loves James Dean or the part of me that's like, live fast and die hard and that's what I feel like I'm doing. Um, I think it's easy for people to see me and think that I'm well, and I get that a lot at work because I'm in nursing, so of course I'm healthy, or I have a bad back and that's it, but I don't have children, so I'm not busy, and I can work 80 hours a week. I've worked really, really hard to learn how to take care of myself, and I'm not going to let you screw it up. I'm sorry, and if it costs me my job, you're probably going to be in the wrong, because 
I don't think working 16 hour days is good for anybody, even though legally you can make me do it. Um, I'm not working that much, thankfully. Um, I'm hoping to get some more ink, but that's an expensive prospect, but at this point it seems very necessary. Um, anybody who has it will understand. Um, yeah. So, posting video. In bed. Should be asleep. Okay. My head hurts from the sun and stuff, so. You guys take care of me well. I'm around. Um, I'm on third, so I'm actually trying to catch up a little bit on videos, which has been pretty easy. And, um, yeah. Bubbles looking at me like she's gonna kill me because she wants bubbles. Bubbles? Come here. Come get them. Come here. You can show the people how you eat the bubbles. Come here. Oh, she's mad. She won't stand up and eat them. Come here. Come here. Mm -hmm. My dog eats bubbles. Alright, you guys. Take care, we will.